um, multiple choice questions, and you're going to be able to answer these PowerPoint, these multiple choice questions using this handheld device, and you'll notice that there are numbers and letters on these. And the multiple choice questions, as you'll see in a moment, have choices that you can select one through four. It's very simple to use. What you'll be doing is pushing the number on your remote control that corresponds with your thoughts about that particular question. And if it's done right, if you push hard enough, and sometimes you do have to push pretty hard, you'll see that number pop up in this little red screen on the front of your remote control. If you are pushing the button and you don't see that number pop up, it could be that your battery is dead or something's wrong with that remote, but have no fear. We brought plenty of them with us. So if you're having a problem with yours, hold it up in the air and um, Kathy or Jessica will be able to run you uh, a new one so that you, way you can uh, participate that way. So again, there are two ways that you can participate. You can participate using the handheld remote, which I hope each and every one of you do, but I also want to open this up for a real live conversation. And so I'm gonna be starting a dialogue here in a moment. The reason we're doing these and we are listening to you is because we want to capture your feedback. We want you to tell us your thoughts about the future of Medicare and Social Security. We want to hear how important Medicare or Social Security is to you. If it's not important, we want to know how you feel about future generations and what could potentially happen to these programs in the future. So in order to capture all of this information, I've invited uh, AARP Lando Lakes chapter member, Jean Poole, who is also an AARP advocate and trained speaker. And you'll notice he is jotting down notes right now. That's because everything that we say today, we want to be able to capture these comments and record them in a report that I'm going to send up to our national office. And all of these compiled reports from the conversations that we're having all over the country, all over the state, and all over uh, the communities here in the Tampa Bay area, we're going to compile a huge report that has all of your comments and feedback. Send that up the line to AARP's National Board of Directors, which is an all-volunteer board, and they're the ones who decide what AARP's position is going to be on various issues, including Medicare and Social Security. We also want to use these compiled reports to share them with the media, and I do want to point out that we do have members of the media here today. Um, we have 88.5 WNMF. M. MNF. MNF. I knew I'd get the initials wrong, but it is 88.5 FM. 